All right, here we are with the battle versus Seth. We see a Rotom, just regular old Rotom. Uh, we see Flygon, couldn't remember his name. Uh, we see PZ, and we see Amistar. Okay. Um, no Tauros, no Kadabra. On the thing that I have, he doesn't have Rotom, which is weird. Um, maybe I took the screenshot before he was done fixing his team, which is kind of annoying, but it's okay. Um, Blastoise still fucks his team up. We do just lead Frostlass. This is the first time I haven't brought Ambipom as well, so that might he might have been hard... Uh, Hard lead for that with like a uh, weak armor Amistar or something. But uh, I wrote down his team. Let's fucking do it, dude. We're going up against the boy Seth. Absolute homie. And uh, this is round three of BFO, you know? If you haven't been following the BFO, this is just... It's four for four, dude, you know? It's like Wendy's. You just you set up, you get four Pokemon, and you just go to town. That's all you do. Um, I don't really want to fuck around with this. I kind of just want to Shadow Ball. I am going to Shadow Ball. And now that the thing is gone. That boy bulky as shit, huh? Ooh, Shadow Ball just doesn't do that much. Unfortunate. Frostlass kind of fucking sucks, huh? <laughs> um, I do want to go for a spike of my own. He does withdraw. Into the Flygon. Okay. Interesting. We get up a spike. Nice. So he has a Stealth of Rock. And I have a spike. Amistar is at like 55. Um, I guess he might have been predicting a taunt or something there. I don't actually know. I'm just going to go Ice Beam. Okay, he just U-turns out. Nice. Just gonna click Ice Beam. Um, we could see a Rotom. No, I think we would just see the Amistar come back in. Probably, if I had to assume. And we know that Flygon is Scarf. We do see a Rotom. Wow. Um, unless he's... If, could he be... Could he be... Double Scarf? No way... No way this guy's double scarf. No way this man's double scarf. He's so gonna be double scarf. He's fucking double scarf, dude. <laughs> that's pretty hilarious. That's pretty hilarious. Uh, we did get up a spike though, so that's cool. That is pretty cool. Frostlass did die. So we can go Blastoise, Staraptor, or Entei. Um, Entei would be pretty cool. Entei would be pretty cool. We could Sacred Fire into Solar Beam. Actually, I think we would just have to hard Solar Beam. I could also go Blastoise. How much is how much is Scarf? Let's find out how much just Scarf Rotom's Shadow Ball. It does not do anything to Blastoise, dude. I think I can just go Blastoise now. I think I just go Blastoise now. In it, I think we just go Blastoise now. Yeah. He does Shadow Ball. And at plus two, we should outspeed this. We should outspeed this, and I don't think... I don't think there's really a... I don't know. Let's find out what happens, because I am scared. I tell you what. Um, we just click Surf. We do just click Surf. Goes on the star. Takes a spike. 
Nice. Take the surf to the mouth. And Amistar's got a pretty big mouth, dude. I, in fact, named my Amistar's Smash Mouth because of the uh, fact that his mouth looks like the Super Smash Brothers logo, you know? Here comes PZ. PZ with the spike. I'm just gonna surf. Surfing USA. What if he's like invested to live this and has psych up? That'd actually be fire as fuck. I do have Aqua Jet if that is the case, but that would be fire as fuck, you know? Porygon Z. Did I miss it? He does just die. Okay. Porygon Z faints the Blastoise. He's got his two Scarfers left. We do have Ice Beam for the Flygon, and we do have uh, just Surf for the, the guy, you know? And we know this is Choice Scarf. We know I have speed for it. Let's go. Let's fucking go, dude. Flygon goes down. All that's left is Rotom. All that's left is Rotom. Um, I think Kadabra was kind of necessary for Blastoise. That was something that I thought about in prep. I was like, this is what's, I mean, that's what stops it. Uh, and he doesn't get a multi-hit move, so I was kind of fucked. But no, no, uh, no Kadabra is just pretty cool with me, you know? So, uh, Shell Smash Blastoise sweep, dude. Fuck Sharpedo, you know what I mean? We got that guy off the squad as soon as possible. But we can, we went hard Blastoise. Um, I don't think, yeah. I don't think he can lock himself into uh, Shadow Ball there because that let this happen, you know? But, you know what? Dude, I don't know what the fuck's going on. That's Pokemon for you. This in these 4v4s, dude, anything is possible. There's so much shenanigans going on that uh, I think it's like whoever gets the lead right has a much better time in the game. Like they will There's got to be a percentage that we could check in BFO and be like, "Okay, well like, look, if you get the lead right 75% of the time you win, you know?" I've never seen so many do duos pop out of this bitch. What is going on? I've just been chilling. But uh thanks guys for watching. Definitely check out Seth. Like I said, great homie. Uh, gonna meet up with them IRL soon. We're gonna go do some fun stuff. So like, subscribe, do all that bullshit. Once again, getting real close to 300. So hit the like and subscribe and do all that fun stuff. And uh, you know, maybe we'll do something fun for 300. Peace.